This is an NBC News special report. Here's Lester Holt. Good day from New York. I'm here with our chief legal correspondent, Savannah Guthrie. We're about to hear publicly for the first time in many years from O.J. Simpson. Just moments from now, the former football star, now prison inmate, number 1027820, will plead for his freedom before Nevada parole board. Simpson, who just turned 70 just this month, has been behind bars for more than oh, yes. eight years yes, so. for a 2007 armed robbery of sports memorabilia, items he claimed belonged to him. And Lester, of course, Simpson will always be best known for being tried and acquitted for the 1994 murder of his ex-wife, Nicole Brown Simpson, and her friend, Ron Goldman. Simpson was then found liable for those deaths in a civil trial and ordered to pay tens of millions. This was a story in which so many of our national fault lines intersected, race, celebrity, the justice system, the media, and it all played out before a huge audience on television. Now, Simpson will appear before a television camera once again in just a few moments, making his case to four members of the Nevada Parole Board. The board is in Carson City, Nevada. Simpson himself is more than 100 miles away. He'll be speaking by video link from the Lovelock Correctional Center. And we see they, the board has taken their seats, still waiting for Mr. Simpson to enter the room uh, at, at the other end. NBC's Joe Fryer is there in Lovelock uh, covering this story for us today. Joe, walk us through what we're about to see. Well, O.J. Simpson will be sitting in that room answering questions from the commissioners. To his left will be his attorney, Malcolm Laverne. Also inside that room, some of his supporters. They include his sister, Shirley Baker, his daughter, Arnell, and his friend, Tom Scotto. One friend or relative will have the opportunity to speak on Simpson's behalf. There's someone else who is in that room right now, and that's one of the robbery victims, Bruce Fromong. He has said in the past that he has forgiven Simpson he plans to testify in favor of O.J. Simpson's release. 